turned up to this one. Customer said they had no hot water. It's on at the programmer, so have a look in the airing cupboard. Looks like an S-Plan system, so just going to check to make sure the cylinder stat was cooling, which it is. Something I always check as well is the overheat stat, which is just there, to make sure that hasn't tripped for any reason. I noticed a new two port already, so I think this is an existing problem, but the zone valve is open. So let's go and check the boiler. The boiler doesn't even have a permanent life by the looks of it. So let's whip out the breakdown bible, go down to the S-Plan system, fault finding flow chart for no hot water. The programmer display was on, but there wasn't anything at the boiler. So I'm going to go to the wiring centre because the boiler was firing for heating. Looks like a wiring jungle in here, it's all over the shop. But we can start determining what things are by looking at the cables off the zone valves. We're looking for 240 on grey, which we're not getting. So the breakdown bible is telling us that we need to check the wiring and it's incorrectly wired because you should always have 240 on grey. So the reason the zone valve was open on the hot water was because you were getting the 240 on the brown but you were getting nothing back on orange because you had no permanent live on grey. So although it was open in the valve it wasn't allowing 240 from grey to orange because it wasn't on the, on the grey to start from. So you can see here no voltage on orange but we're getting 240 to the brown for this valve. So now I'm gonna turn hot water off so nothing's cooling. I'm gonna go back up and I'm gonna check that again. So now we're not getting 240 on hot water on, which is what we should get. We turn the heating on, hot water off, and then we go up and we'll find the heating on. So now I'm gonna turn both off, but weirdly the room stat's still got power. So I think that it's wired incorrectly in the back of the programmer I think permanent live is crossed with heating on. So I'm just gonna check that now by putting them safely in Wagos and then cross them over. Now to turn it back on, nothing's cooling. Room stat's not getting power. The boiler's now got a permanent live. Now you can see 240 on gray. Now I'm gonna turn hot water on at the programmer, go up to the boiler, that's lit up and firing. So that's another one done, happy days.